smooth move. You've got his key ring. It wouldn't be prudent to do that at this juncture. This little unit is a portable dehumidifier. When you're a guy like Singent, who sweats like a bicranial crud snorter, you need one of these things going all the time. That label won't come off. It's a somewhat damaged CD-ROM disc. It's that Lard Master's key ring. Don't pick at it, you'll only make it worse. Sorry, but the posters have to stay. Besides, who needs posters you can't unroll the next day? It's apparently programmed to be locked, perhaps to prevent unauthorized entry.
Well, 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 the worm is out of the hole. So, you have to ask yourself, do I feel lucky? Well, do I punk? It would appear that merging those two items is not a good idea. This box is full of daddies. That is, a modules which, when inserted into intracranial slots, give the user complete knowledge of whatever topic is programmed into that particular daddy. You rummage around in the box to look for something useful, but all you find is an almost complete set of line dancing in zero-G daddies. Only volume two, the achy breaky, appears to be missing. The room seems to be vibrating ever so slightly. The telltale residue of a local damping field. You poke and prod amongst the moddies until you find... a moddy labeled churlish. Being intrigued by the word, you glom it. Incidentally, you might want to look up the word churlish before you do anything stupid. The corner of the label in this modi seems to be loose.